Hello everybody, welcome back to another edition of the EcoStructure Machine Expert Training. I'm your host Leandro Mada and in this video we're going to talk about the navigators that we have on the software. So let's go to the software. So we have already created our application. So in the past we have so machine, uh, we have so much motion. Um, depend on how you work, okay, you have um, different views about the application. So we have the the new look that if you are familiar with the sew machine, probably you already have these three uh, independent uh, navigations, which are divided, which are divided in three uh, in three parts. You have the device tree, where you can see the hardware of your application, where you are going to add all your PLCs and models and everything in there, all the hardware stuff. And then you have the application tree where you can see the code, okay, of the application, of the POUs, GBLs that we're going to talk about later. And then we have the tools tree that allows you to see, for example, the files manager, the recipes, and it allows you to see the visualization and, and other stuff, okay. But we also have the classic navigation, which is over here in the view, classic navigation devices and here you can see all the devices that you have and all the application so let's start just an example just to show you how it is how we can add one device okay one plc for example so we just go into training into the device tree okay add device oops it's in the other side let me just minimize this a little bit here you can find all the devices that are in your system. You have the motion, you can see you have the pack drive, M262, okay, the motion part, and in the logic you also have the M262. So I'm going to start with this small M262 over here. You can change the name or not, it's up to you. And also you can change, if you have different versions of the software, you can see different versions of this. So add device into the application. It's creating and deleting all the files and everything. Okay, there we go. So as you can see over here, okay, you can see in the device tree, which is the, the new navigation, okay, I have only the hardware. And in devices, I have the hardware, and inside I have the logic of the PLC and everything all together over here, okay. That um, for me, I like to have everything separated, okay. But there are people to have all together. It's the same. It's the same information, different way to see it. So if you pay attention over here in the application tree, you can see here the application, okay, and not part of the hardware, the application. And then you can see over here that you have the GBL, the default GBL, and then you have the task where the POU is going to be called. Okay. So it's a different way to see everything. Okay, you can see here that you have in the application have the library and I have it here on the tools tree, which are the additional elements that are going to be in the application, okay, as visualization and so on. So this is the different navigations, okay, that you have in the EcoStructure Machine Expert version 1.2 or 2.0. And it should be the same for so machine or so machine motion. Okay, so this is it for the navigation okay i check explain how to add a small device okay but we're gonna cover that later so um thank you very much for watching this video and i see you on the next one